Good evening. Jeff Lore is off tonight. I'm Bianca Goladriga, and this is our Western Edition. We will get to the extraordinary dispute between the president and the chief justice in a moment. But first, the holiday rush hit a snag today. Overhead wire problems in New Jersey caused delays on Amtrak's busiest line. Frustrated riders jammed New York's Penn Station. This as a record number of Americans fly out for the holiday. Many more are on the roads with a brutal cold snap hitting the Northeast. Chris Van Cleve begins our coverage. To make the great getaway, flyers had to first navigate a crush of long lines at airports like these in Denver and here in Chicago. My dad was sending like five texts today being like, you better get to the airport early. It's really crazy. <laughs> the day before Thanksgiving found the Harper family at Chicago's O'Hare Airport prepared for the worst. We left two and a half hours early and got here in like a half an hour. At American Airlines Reagan National Airport Operations Center, the focus was getting all 255 DC flights on their way. Our primary goal is bags and people where they want to be on time all the time. More than 54 million Americans are expected to travel for Thanksgiving, the most since 2005. More than 4 million of them are flying, which could make for a long day for customer service supervisor Milo Michael. I do on average about 15,000 steps a day. This flight aware map shows the flights across America today, but the bulk of the travel comes on the roads. We believe this started as an accident. A deadly car fire snarled traffic on the Brooklyn Bridge today, shutting it down for hours. Drivers tonight find themselves riding the brakes as they try to escape ahead of Thanksgiving. Take a look at this. This is the 405. And this look at last night's epic strangle. backup on the 405 in Los Angeles. Traffic there tonight is expected to be even worse. And late Wednesday, passengers on an Amtrak train from Albany to New York City were stranded after their train's engine decoupled from their cars. A rescue train is on its way to get them. This is the sold out flight 293. It's going to a much warmer Miami. The thing about being down here on the ramp, it's all about beating the clock, getting the passengers and the bags on board so this plane can push off and depart on time. Today was busy. Sunday is expected to be the busiest of the Thanksgiving holiday travel season. Bianca, Thank you so much, Chris.